All right, welcome back to the channel. All right, special video for you all here today. We are headed to the supercharger here in Bowie, Maryland. So check this out. We are about four or five minutes out, uh, two miles or so. And uh, I was just jamming out to this new Shabuzi song. And uh, yeah, this song is hitting hard, especially right after the 4th of July. And yeah, I think this guy is from Woodbridge, I heard. And that's pretty epic for him to be putting out a, like an all-American hit like that. That's pretty cool. So shout out to Sh Shabuzi uh, from Woodbridge. Definitely put out a banger for 4th of July. And uh, yeah, hope everyone watching this had a great 4th of July. Everyone, all the Americans. And uh, yeah, it was definitely a fun one. I, I actually celebrated it in Annapolis this year, first time, because I'm normally out in DC, and uh, I always see the DC show, I've almost seen it from all angles, and it's, it's really cool, I love the DC show, but I was out here in Maryland, and I, I thought to check out the Annapolis show this year, and wow, I was stunned. Annapolis is where it's at. They, they were so packed, so many people were out, and it was just amazing to see um, yeah, the show was awesome. It was right on Main Street in front of the harbor with, um, with Yachts Park, with American flags all up. It, it was, it was epic, I have to say. You know, what a show they put on. And, uh, yeah, it was just amazing to be in attendance. And, yeah, uh, so here I am in this area still. So we're checking out the buoy supercharger. And, uh... <clears throat> I am preconditioning my car for fast charging, which is what the car will automatically do when you start routing to a supercharger. Now, <clears throat> this is one of the only times I've used a supercharger in 2024. Uh, I very rarely use it. I, you know, charge at home and whatnot. There's a charger by my job, and uh, yeah. But I, I figured I did a little bit of extra driving. Had the AC cranking all weekend and or. You know, 4th of July weekend is just starting because it's, it's Friday. It just doesn't feel like a Friday. Uh, but yeah, uh, you know, it's cool every once in a while when you want to use it, then the superchargers are here. Let's hope that there's no weight or anything like that. Um, and yeah, you'll see it live. You know, if there is, then I will find out. Oh, it looks like it actually, you know, pre-tells me that there's two available. So that's pretty cool. And uh, I, I even think that they have the data showing that there's like one or two cars in route to this place so we'll like even alert you saying like hurry up and get there <laughs> or for whatever reason but <laughs> as you can see fsd is driving the car here and it's doing a really good job it's trying to figure out where to go um, as well as keeping in mind all the surroundings with the traffic light coming up and the car slowing down notice that i haven't touched anything um pedals you know steering surroundings it's all done with tesla's vision system which is quite remarkable and uh definitely a really cool thing to see them solving a real world issue and uh they're solving that for everyone and that's the truth you know all these cars here are meant to be points of safety you know they look at every car equal not tesla not ford not chevy not honda rivian it's all cars and you know they treat everything equally and you know they're solving real world issues because these are routes that people take in the real world and a lot of people drive teslas now so it's getting it's getting up there i'm starting to notice more and more of them so here we go with the left turn notice how the fsd got me in the left turn lane all by itself and now what it's going to do is try to make this left on a green yield just gonna be kind of difficult let's see what it sees over here <clears throat> notice how you get that extended view which sometimes is hard for the driver to see in the situation but if FSD can see it then you know the maneuver is possible and look how it goes just gracefully perfectly and you know honestly I could have done no better that was just picture perfect. And here we go, gliding through the shopping center. 
I do notice it does get a little close to the right sometimes, but maybe I just feel like that because I'm not driving. But yeah, as you can see, we're pulling up to the Wawa's, I think. Yeah, here we go. And it looks like the supercharger is right in the back of the Wawa's. Let's see how close it can take me to the supercharger point. Uh, granted, this is FSD, but it looks like this is the destination. So I may have to, no, I haven't, don't have to take over yet. Car is still driving. How about that? Let's see if it'll even make this right. That would be incredible if it does. Oh, it did. How about that? Oh my God, it's actually pulling me up exactly in front of where I need to go. This is incredible, wow. All right, now it looks like I have to take over. I guess I'm gonna try to snag this spot here. So one little accelerator tap. No, maybe not even that. Yeah, so if I just take over here and then just pick this spot, let the car do it by itself, and then let's see what happens. All right, this is pretty cool. And let's see how long this is gonna take too. All right, here we go. Damn, very gracefully parking the car. And uh, yeah, let's see how long this is gonna take now. Auto park complete just like that. And let's go ahead and plug it in. And look at that, it says 20 minutes remaining until my limit. And voila, just like that, I think I'm gonna run in and grab some Diet Cokes, which was a request from my brother, so on my way to go see him. And yeah, I wanna thank everyone for watching this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. This was definitely a fun one to shoot. As you can see, I did zero driving. The car completely drove itself here. Um, didn't really have to do anything even when I got here did the auto park by itself too see now that this guy left to my right I would have liked to snag the charger to the right so that way I'm not right next to this guy because then it snags and uses both chargers together you know and, and it takes less energy for both chargers so as you can see the session right now is costing one dollar it's 51 cents per kilowatt which is pretty expensive um, usually, you know, it started when I started driving, I used to see like 23 cent kilowatt and that's like doubled at this point. So yeah, that just goes to show, you know, uh, at home it's around 13 to 20 cents kilowatt. So yeah, prices are a lot cheaper. And uh, yeah, I think I'm only going to sit here for maybe 10 more minutes because I don't really need the entire charge, but yeah want to thank everyone again for watching this and uh hopefully you enjoyed it if you did hit that like button and make sure you subscribe for more thanks again for watching and hope you have a great rest of your day